Really quick, I would like to welcome all you newcomers to my channel, and if you haven't already, go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter for the most up-to-date information on my channel and what it covers, which is hardcore gaming and thought. And also be sure to check out my sponsor and their Discord at Quixotic Nation, Discord link below. There you can get access to many giveaways as well as find many Twitch streamers and other YouTubers. But anyway, thank you for supporting my content and enjoy the video. Hello to all of my viewers and loyal subscribers. You know, my name is Dom, and today I felt like bombing the shit out of people. Yo, know, you may be asking yourself, am I listening to music right now? Well, fuck yeah I am because it helps me focus. You can go ahead and guess what song I'm listening to down in the comment section below. I can already tell you right now I'm gonna get some pretty mean shit down there, so just... Now, you know, in spirit, this is really an artillery revisited video, but I thought it'd be slightly more entertaining uh, to to say, let's let's bomb the shit out of some people, right? But you know, as always, before I begin, if you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe so you can keep up to date with all of my future content, and uh, also drop me a like, that's the way you can support my channel, as you notice there are no ads on these videos. You guys have been sending me mad responses to my artillery video, and basically all across, you know, uh, uh, my, my, my channel, you're just basically saying, artillery, artillery's great, artillery's great, artillery's great, okay, okay, okay. All right, so I decided to dive into this for myself once again, and I am here to discuss this. I, I, ba I basically reached two conclusions. Either artillery's mortar is not good for killing people, or I'm not good with it, but please feel free to tell me what you guys think down in the comment section below, and go ahead and sandbag me if, uh, if you want to. First off, I love the MP5. The MP5, I feel like it's just a pea shooter. It really doesn't do shit, even if you are hitting people. It's always nice to get called out by a previous fucking video. Anyways, you know, I don't even know if they changed the MP5 or not, but anyway, I love that son of a bitch. Pick whatever gun you fucking want. Now please, for the love of God, play tactically with artillery. What that means is, you're not gonna pull a one-man army with them. I know, I think that's what everybody expects when they play. You know, they expect to drop a mortar and kill four people. It just doesn't happen. I've seen one clip. I've seen one fucking clip on Reddit where, where that happens, but... It doesn't happen most of the time, so please go ahead and prepare yourself with a squad mate who is go either going to take out enemies in a building that you lock down with your mortar, so you put it on there so people can't flee from the exits, and then that teammate's gonna go in, pop, pop, kill motherfuckers, you know what I mean? Let me check high. There he is. Where? Right there. Somebody's got a mort right here in this building. Hey, yo, John Boy, you want me to uh, drop a mortar on that building? Oh, Alright, man. Tanks right there, too. Yeah, there you right go. There. Or, make sure you have a teammate that's going to be picking off people that are fleeing from your mortar. Now, you know, just for clarity's sake, those classes would look something like... Also, go ahead and use Drone Pilot as your perk. You know, you live for your mortar. As it, The only reason to pick artillery is for his mortar. Um, you know, I mean, I guess another reason is for his mines, but don't call me out on that shit. Make sure you, you know, you have drone pilots so you can use his mortar a, as much as possible. That's... That's why. So, awesome. You know, now I believe we have a firm grounding. Uh, in how to play artillery. So how do we play tactically? Well, first we have to ask ourselves the question What is a tactic? Well, a tactic is a is defined as an action or strategy That is carefully devised to it to achieve a specific goal, right? And in this case the specific goal is winning Hopefully that is you that is what you're trying to do every single match a tactic is anything that helps achieve your that goal So anyway, hold on to your ass because Dom's about to speak the truth if the symbol a is a tactic and is designed to reach the goal X, in this case X is winning, then A intends to lead to X. So now if something does not intend to lead to X, it cannot be A. So what does this mean? Keep your intentions in check. Now what the fuck I'm calling you out on here is holding grudges against particular players in a match or combating a certain play style that rubbed you the wrong way. You know, maybe they just kicked you in the balls the first round and you're saying, okay, I'm gonna do the same thing back. I'm gonna do that back. I'm gonna beat him. Your intention is not to win at that point, so keep that shit off to the side, please. That's not a fucking tactic. So now, with all this being said, the tactic for artillery is pretty simple. You're gonna wanna go ahead and lock down buildings with your mortar, of course, if you know somebody's in there. Lock it down by throwing a mortar on it so that it pretty much encompasses all the exits. And then, have your guys storm the fort. 
And now for that other person, I would recommend, I mean, preferably a shotgun, because when you're aiming down sights in a building that's getting hit by a fucking earthquake bomb, your screen tends to shake a little bit, and your aim goes a little fucking wonky, so you, if you can hip fire, that's great. I'd recommend a shotgun. You know, or also the obvious thing is if someone is locked, is, is stuck in a specific spot and you don't want to risk someone getting killed to going and get th getting them and they're in an open area, go ahead, drop the mortar and they'll be flushed. There you go. Uh, dropping that shit right on him. <laughs> He's good. Oh, there's one right there. Flushed out. Also, I always send this shit up right at the beginning. I'm going up now. Yep, I'm just gonna do what they did. Rush the building. Ah, there we go. Yeah. Come on, die. Come on. Because who knows, I might get a lucky kill, but using the mortar with the intent to kill is is pretty much dumb. You basically want to use it just to sort of create a little hole where the enemy team cannot go and just kind of create a, 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 a flux, if you will, so they so they fan out. They fan out in certain directions, you know, so they, like that. Do not, you know, I, I just mentioned this, but do not use it to, with the intent to kill. The intent to kill is very specific and unique, so don't use that often. Now, one strategy that I did find with the mortar, actually, uh, today this shit was actually pretty fucking cool. Um... I came up with this on the fly and I'm like, oh, that's that actually worked pretty well. So in this unique situation, I was behind cover. I was being shot at from like two, three enemies. So I sent up my mortar quick. I fired off around right in front of me where these people were at so I could hightail it out of there. And yeah, I used the mortar as a as a support actually to su to kind of suppress for a moment. <laughs> Fuck it, let me see what I can do here. Not to die. All right, appreciate you. Uh, worked out great, but actually, I don't kill anybody with this fucking mortar. Um, but anyway, as always, if you guys like the video, please drop me a like, um, and I will see you guys in the next one. And be sure to let me know what you guys think, because that's what I care about most. Honestly, I do give a shit about what you guys think, so please let me know down in the comment section below. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.